Hey everyone, it's Raiden! Hey everyone, it's Dan here, and welcome to Nuzlocke Episode 2. Hey, what are you- Hey, what are you doing here, Dan? I thought you were a Minecraft guy. Wait, what did you do to Reddington? Uh, wait, was I, did I just say that out loud? Yes, I'm curious, because it got blurred by the communication-y thing. You mean the, uh, Pokédex? No, I mean... No. Oh, hi, Elmo! I heard you beat May on your first try, that's excellent. But I'm still wondering what Dan did to Remington. May's been helping with my research for a long time. In fact, ever since she could walk, she was helping me. May has an extensive history as a trainer already. Here, Elmo, I ordered this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokédex. I want to see the Pokédex. Give it to me! Hang on, hang on, guys. I, I'm gonna go real quick. I, uh, something just arrived at the door. Shut up, Tesla! Shut up! Ah, there we are. Has Remington come back yet? Don't tell me you sent him to the goon squad, Dan. Well. <laughs> Dan. What? I thought we said the goon squad was strictly off limits to anyone on this channel. Pokedex, blah, blah, blah. I told you not to send anyone to the goon squad. Yay, Remington! Okay, fine. Dan, since Remington managed to get away from the goon squad this time, I'll let you off the hook. You can help with this episode. Maybe. Yay! Uh, I'm still not happy that you sent him to the goon squad. Wow. Da, 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 da. Yay, I got some balls! Yay, we have Pokeballs now. Alright, so, whatever we encounter on this first drought, we're going to catch it and give it a nickname. And I'm also thinking about going up to Route 102, where we battled May to catch something. So, since Dan is kind of our guest-ish person-y thing, do you have any ideas for what we should do? Ooh, for nicknames, Dan? Dan? Remington! Well, I guess I'm alone now. Your father's shot. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, honey, if it goes. Oh, yes, I love my running shoes. Still never got why you can't run in buildings. Oh, it's kind of a dumb restriction. Yeah. Thank you. 
friends. They're going to help you in this knock off, most likely. Oh no, I think the Wi Fi is going down. Going down hard. Harder than ever before, the Wi Fi is crashed. Uh, I guess I'm on my own for this episode. Well, everyone, it's time to take our first step and see what we encounter. And it's a wormhole. Okay. All right. I'll take it. Hmm. Uh, no, this isn't good. Mm -hmm. uh, tackle! Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Oh, darn, I fainted it. Darn it! This isn't good. Guess I'm gonna have to go up here and get something. Okay, Poochie M. I'll take it. Uh. Okay, um... Let's just not risk it. Let's just catch it. Okay, ball. Yes! Awesome. Uh, Puchiana. Uh, gosh, I don't know what to nickname. I don't know what to nickname a Puchiana. Uh, I mean, uh, when I think of Poochiana or Mariana, uh, I think of the Lion King hyenas. Uh, what should I do? I'm asking the other two for suggestions. Gosh, why can't I get on Wi-Fi? I mean, that's honestly how I'm getting through to these two. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. I can't go in. Uh, well, um, well, then. Come on. Uh, I need a villain. I seriously need a villain name. This is frustrating. Uh, gosh, what 
<laughs> Why is it always me? I'll try this, I guess. Uh, no, I can only get one person then. For some reason, I keep thinking I hear the Pokémon Ranger music. I have no clue why, but I keep on thinking that I do. Uh, and it's always the same one. Back to trying to nickname that Poochiana, and I say we because we have Remington back now. Yay! Hello. I figured out my technical difficulties. I got an apple. And Rem, what do you think we should nickname our first cat, a female Poochiana? Uh, female Poochiana. We're doing villains, right? Let's yeah. See. What's a female villain? Not one Harley Harley. Harley? Harley. Where's that from? Batman. Oh, is that that chick in the, uh, in the Dark Knight Rises? Uh, I would assume so. She's the Joker's kind of sidekick person. Kind of oh, 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 maybe, maybe. And I need this. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, oh, there. Sorry, sorry, Rem. Sorry about that. It's nothing special. Just feeling. Alright, so we're about to go into our first ride of trainers. Yay, what's Wow. Up? Oh, man. I am. Before. That would make an unfortunate Nuzlocke. Don't jinx us, Rem. Did All you right. talk to the Pokemart man? Because he'll give us a free potion. No, I didn't. Uh, we went into a wild route. Oh, Lotad. That's not Lotad's bad. That's not bad. Not bad at all. It's a, it, I actually really like it. Okay, let's start thinking of nicknames. And in case you guys haven't noticed, something happened to Cyrus. We're not really sure what. If you have a good story as to why Cyrus changed genders, Please let us know in the comments. Yes. Yeah. We're very excited to hear your story. Yeah. So It'll make some very right? interesting fanfic. Alright. And we'll probably be doing some grinding. Yeah, we better. Good thing that. Right. Okay, what do we want to name it? Look at... I don't know. What, what, uh, is it a male or a female? It's a female. We literally, right now, have only females on our team. Well, that's interesting. Um, should we name another, should we just keep it? Hang on, wait, uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, gosh. Uh, hey, Rem, can you do me a favor? Yeah. There is a green-haired Team Flare scientist. Can you please search her for me? I, com I, I, I got it. Yeah. So just start playing. Green play. hair, team flare, hey, the rush. Mm hmm. Scientist. Mm hmm. And research. 
Bryony. I was thinking Mabel. I think she's like the purple haired one. I am not sure. I have yet to play the next one. That's right, because you don't own a 3DS like a noob. It's unfortunate. Okay. Let's do a bit of rearranging with our team. Are we going to heal first? Uh, maybe. Zigzagoon. Oh, Zigzagoon. I always thought that Zigzagoon had, like, a burglar. But, I believe that Zigzagoon is going to be the one that we should be using. Holy crud, that did a ton of damage there. Five damage? Holy crud. Switch out. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Can you tell me how high Zigzagoon's attack is? Researching. Can't be that high. Because I know Bootsiana has mediocre defenses. Yeah, Bootsiana's not the best. Not a big fan. Yeah. Early game, yes. Late game, no way. Yeah. All right, we definitely need a heal. Well, it says it's base stat, attack is base 30. So, wow. that's bad. What? Okay, then what is Poochiana's defense? It must be like negative 4. No, I think it's... Google it for me. I I'm honestly curious. I still never got why you can't run in buildings. Probably because it took a ton of code. But, Probably. Well, defense. actually, I'm taking a computer defense. science class. Its defense is 35. How is this doing that much damage? Well, I know the damage formula, how it's calculated. That is wild, though. Because it it's getting it stabbed. Oh, it's getting... Yeah, it's getting stab off tackle. Yeah. That might have been most of it. Yeah, stab. Plus there's like this whole random number thing. Where uh it's, and you're right. Lutana's attack is its best stat. How high, might I ask? Fifty five. Ah, awesome. Yeah, I think Mighty Anna sports like an outrageous attack stat for when you yeah. get it. What is our first level limit? It's uh let's see, 14. Uh, 15, 15, 15, that's it. Yeah, 15. Yeah, because uh the level 13 nose pass. No, 15 nose pass. I based it off of their highest level. Oh, it's With the exception of Wallace. Yeah. Gosh, that's level gonna be 15, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I might play through an Emerald. Well, not play through, I'm not recording it, but... It's a playthrough, you're fine. playing through the game. Yeah. Let's but buy a few potions. That person. notepad looks annoying. Rock Tomb does, but it's really annoying. Yeah. I really hate Rock Tomb. I mean, I'm glad that we have Mudkip. No. Okay. So, I think we should... Do you think we should go against the trainer? And I guess we have to. Up. If you have Pokemon with you, then you're an official trainer. You can't say no to my challenge. <laughs> this game has such great music, and I'm so excited for Auras because it's coming out in two days! Two days! Oh. 3DS. Why yeah. do they make stuff all 3DS? Just go back to like the regular. I don't understand. Remington. Nintendo has turned its back. Whoa! Whoa! We definitely need to. It used Howl, and I was worried about that. Oh my gosh. Harley, you need a good rest. Cyrus, I'm sorry, buddy. You're gonna be so overleveled. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. It's okay. I think Mudkip has pretty good stats. I'll check him out. Yeah. I know Mudkip. Oh, we're. Oh my gosh. Two and a half times. The... It's a. I'm getting scared right now. What did you say that Fujiana's attack stat was? 45? 55. 55? It's now at plus 4 for Howl, so it's... Yeah. Uh, you do know that... that oh my gosh. I'm so relieved that Fujiana is out of the way. Cool. Oh. Yeah. Like, you have no idea how relieved I am. I guess. I mean, you're kind of the ex. I'm not sure exactly. Pokemon. I will check that. I will check that out. Oh, that we have a swift swim. We have a swift oh, swim, low tad. Yay! Oh, and we have a runaway Pusiana. Joy. Wait, what was that ability? Swift swim. I'm already seeing that we're gonna have a rain team. If we make, yeah. if this team makes it to the Elite Four, we'll have a rain team. Darn it, Harley! <laughs> well, I That's think. Good, mm -hmm. Well, if no, we spam Thunder, he'll be really easy. <laughs> yeah, if we have an electric type, Thunder will be awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because Thunder bypasses accuracy check in rain. Yes, it does. And I guess at level 5, Poochiana will learn to howl based on that youngster. That was honestly what Possibly. I was... That was honestly what I was super worried about. Was just the fact that... I don't the, know, I've never really used... I don't know why, but I've just never really been a fan of stat-raising moves. I just, I just yeah. want to... Oh, You're a Thanks. Cynthia, then. Because Cynthia oh. literally has, I think, one status move in all six of her Pokemon. But, you know, there's actually a really, really awesome version of Mightyena in the trading card game. And, uh, I'll try... I might post a picture of it in the video, but, um... Basically, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, hey, you're back. Yes. Awesome. Uh. All right. Yeah. I, I did. I mean, when I played through uh, Soul Silver, I had a yeah, status moves are great. Gosh, where is it? I've been... My brother and I have been, uh, opening over time a booster box of the latest trading card game expansion, because I really like the trading card game. I think it's a fabulous game. You haven't, uh... Definitely... Ask someone who knows how to play it, how to play. But, uh, I know you know how to play, Rem, so take a look at this, Mariana. Whoa, that's pretty good. Yeah. 90 Not HP bad, for two colorless and one dark, it can deal 80 damage, which is very nice. And for 30 energy, for one colorless and one dark, it does 30 damage. Flip a coin if had discarded energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. Not bad, not bad. Yeah. Uh, should we keep Harley in here? Eh, uh, Mighty N is actually not terrible. Um, Voldor is pretty kick butt in, in the trading card game, in, the, in Phantom Forces. 90 HP. For one fighting energy, you can discard it and heal 50 damage from this Pokemon, which is really nice. 
and then for its attack, it's for its main attack, it's three for sixty, three fighting energy. That is. Uh, maybe I'll post a video of of what we found in our uh, in our trading card game booster box once we finish opening it. Uh, Kingler is awesome. Chansey can deal a hundred damage. But it's only under a very specific condition. Yeah, I've got some pretty cool cards. Like, um, I've gotten Lysander's Trump card in Versus Seeker. I've gotten a Reverse Foil Reggie Gigas. I've gotten, uh, I've gotten quite a few actually so far. My brother and I have, rather. We've gotten a Heliolisk. We've gotten Galvantula, and a handful of others. It's, it's been a good set so far. I really like it. Yeah. Uh, Lysander's trump card goes very well with Versus Seeker, if any of you have that. Alright, so I guess it's time that we use healing item number one of the game. Nice. Potion. Potion. Potion against the Wild Lotad. I just realized, yeah. let's not waste our money on revives and sell them also because can't use them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but as I was so, as I was saying, uh, Versus Seeker and Lysander's Trump card go pretty much hand in hand. Versus Seeker allows you to put a supporter card from your discard pile into your hand, which is always nice to be able to do that. And Harley now has Howl. That is great, Harley. All right. I think I'm going to grind everyone up to level... You know what? I think we can deal with giving Bryony a bit real quick. Alright. But as I was saying, Lysander's Trump card is a really good supporter card. Each player shuffles all cards in his or her discard pile into his or her deck except Lysander's Trump card. So, my recommendation is, you pretty much will have an endless cycle of Versus Seeker and Lysander's Trump cards, basically. Alright, let's see what you can do, Brian. Oh, strange. Can you take a look at, um, at Lotad's stats? I know his best one when he evolves into Ludicolo is, um, Special Defense. But, um, yeah, it had to be special. I didn't know which one it would be, but it had to be special. It's that way it gives a high attack step. Um, low tag. Yeah. I do like that we got low tag. We did not run into the bad game. Low tag is not a bad Pokemon. Zigzagoon is a great. Linoon is a great HM slave. Yeah, but I don't really want to waste the capture on a Linoon until we know. Uh huh. Actually. Its best cat as a low cat is 50 with special defense, followed by 18 and special attack at 40. Yeah, I know low tech. Ludicolo is an awesome wall. I know that. Especially in the rain with its ability Rain Dish. That yeah. thing. Alright. But uh, other good cards that I've looted, or Connor and I have rather. Connor's my brother. Um, we've looted a Zubat, a Golbat, and a Crobat. And when Crobat and Golbat evolve, Golbat says when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon, you may put two damage counters on one of your opponent's Pokemon, which is really good. And then Crobat, it says, when you play this Pokemon, same deal, except you get to put three damage counters, which is even better. So, between the two, if you can deal 50 damage just by evolving Golbat and Crobat. Just by evolving Zubat into Crobat. And if you run four of those in your deck, you can potentially deal 20 you can deal 200 damage without even having to put a single energy on all of them. And all of them are great because they require one colorless energy. 
for their attack, but that's no problem if you so happen to have Dimension Valley, which is a stadium. Whoa, Bryony, you have one HP left? All right, what you just... You deserve a rest, buddy. I'm gonna go into Harley here. But what Dimension Valley does, I... Yeah, it says each psychic Pokemon's attacks cost one colorless energy less. Basically, the Zubat line attacks for no energy. And they have some... And they have actually pretty good attacks. Zubat allows you to hit for 10 damage on anyone. Golbat allows you to hit for 10 damage on everyone. Crobat allows you to hit for 30 damage on anyone on your opponent's game. Which is really nice. So, I think that those two, along, are gonna, along with Dimension Valley, I'm definitely going to build a deck with those three. For sure. If you want to take a look at them, Rem, there's... There's Zubat, right. Zubat, right. Gawbat, Crawbat, Dimension. Nice. Yeah, maybe Connor and I will burst each, will play against each other one of these days with with that deck in mind. Yeah, some of these ideas, I I don't know how I got that idea. I just kind of happened to think. Wait a minute. Yeah, that was my inspiration. Raiden's wise words, guys. Just look at the deck and see what you can wreak, wreak havoc with. You know, Rem, if there's anything that I'm worried about in Oras, it's going back to Hoenn without the physical special split. I'm sorry, with the physical special split. That is going to be a nightmare. I get some of the yeah. Elite Four, like Sydney and Drake. Because, if you remember, Dark types used to be physically based, but all mo Dark moves were special attacks. Yeah, that was really annoying. Mm-hmm. You know what I am? Just speaking of special attacks, you know what I am kind of disappointed that we didn't run into on this ra route. What? We did get a low tag. We did get a low tag. No, no, I'm saying that, like, I'm disappointed we did not run into a route. <laughs> Even though you can't really train that very well until it gets to level 7. But, I am playing with Gardevoir, and that thing is ridiculous. Mm hmm. Special attack is just beyond insane. Ah, sorry, Rem, but I'm Team Gallade. I'm sorry, but I love my Gallade so much. No, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I've actually never had a Gallade. I'll have to get one sometime. Yeah, Gallade is definitely a very strong Pokemon. Uh, he's got solid speed, uh, and if you give him the hidden ability justified, you just beat up on him, ouch, that is going to do some nasty damage when he yeah. hits, because justified, as you may know, raises, raises, raises every dark move that hits will raise his, uh, yeah. How long have we been in this episode for? I have no idea, actually. A long time. I think I'm uh, just going to yeah. try and get to Petalaberg City as fast as possible. And then I'll do some grinding off screen. Yeah. So, yeah. You know what? Getting there as fast as possible means using my... Level 8 mud kit. Sorry, Harley. I don't love my mud kit. Wrong! I like my Swampert my so much. Swampert is... I used to mud kit is probably the best uh, starter current as well. 
At least in Hoenn. Yeah. Uh, for, uh, for the Kanto region, it would probably be Bulbasaur. Uh, probably. Johto, probably, really just not Meganium. Yeah, Meganium. I tried to play with Meganium. That thing is just terrible. I mean, it's great as a support, but why would you want a supporter? Which works yeah, best in double battles. Why would you want that for the single player adventure? Most of the battles are single battles. Why didn't we get a Talo? Those things have ridiculous speed. Like, they have base 90 speed as a Talo. Talo is on the next route. Oh. Well then, I hope we get a Talo. Right outside of Pedal yeah, and I wonder what we're gonna get in the woods. Maybe a shroom. Probably a wormhole or something. Probably something useless. Maybe I'll a shroom. I will be happy. Shroomish or slack off? Oh, that's true. Slack off. I forgot about him. Yeah, I mean, sure. Slacking. He's a tank, though. I can deal with true on. I, I just dislike his ability, but his ability can be countered. Yeah. If we manage to somehow get... Yeah, Tate and Liza, if we somehow get something that can learn Gastro Acid, that's how we counter for it. Or Skill Slot, because... Alright. Because, uh, that's how I would counter. I would, I would yeah. start... Alright, let's go to the gym. Okay, Hi, let's talk to Daddy. Hmm? Well, if it isn't... Oh, oh sorry, sorry. Well, if it isn't... Oh, God. I need a more normal voice. Uh... <coughs> Sorry. Well, if it isn't Elmo, so you're all finished moving in. I'm surprised that you managed to get here by yourself. Oh, well, I you see. You're with your Pokemon. Hmm. And I guess you're going to become a trainer like me, Elmo. Hopefully you don't have as bad of a widow's peak as I do. That's great news. I'll be looking forward to it. Uh, I'm going to get a Pokemon, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. You're Wally. Am I correct? I'm going to get... I'm going to stay with my relatives in Burdensurf Town. I, I thought I'd be lonely by myself. So I wanted to take a Pokemon along. But I never caught a Pokemon before. And I don't know how to. Hmm. I see. Elmo. You heard that, right? Go with Wally and make sure that he safely catches a Pokemon. Wally, here. I'll loan you my Pokemon. That I never use in gym battle. Oh wow, a Pokemon. Hmm. I'll give you a Pokeball too. Go for it. Wally received a Pokeball. Hey, oh wow, thank you. Elmo, did you come with me? I just realized that the tech speed is on medium still. Oh. I'm gonna have to change yeah, that. Yeah, probably should change that. Elmo, course, Pokemon hide in the tall grass really like this. Yeah. Don't they? Please watch me and see if I can catch one properly. Wow. I do not know how he manages to find a Ralts, like, first try. Because, like, Ralts has a 5% so encounter good. rate. And you know, I just realized something. Ralts kind of looks like it has a front... It looks like it has a butt. It has two butt cheeks in the front. I don't know why. That is weird. I, I never got and it looks like it has a salad bowl on its head. Yeah, I mean, weird. don't get me wrong, I love my Gallade. Or Gallade. Or... There's... I've heard three different pronunciations of Gallade. I've heard Gallade. Gallade. I've heard Gallade. Gallade. And Gallade. Gallade. And there's also kind of a gullade. 
please, if anyone at Game Freak ever watches this, please tell me, how do you pronounce Galeg's name? Because I would love to know. Because I heard two different ways in the anime, and then I've heard a third on YouTube. And then there's my way of pronouncing, pronouncing it. Uh, darn it, I said it wrong. Darn it. Oh, Elmo, thank nice. you. Let's go back to the gym. So, did it work out? Oh, man. Thank you. Yes, it did. Turn your Pokemon back. Elmo, thank you for coming along with me. You two are why I was able to catch my Pokemon. I promise I'll take oh, really God. good care of it. Oh, my mom's waiting for me, so I have to go. Bye, Elmo. Now, Elmo, if you want to become a strong trainer, here's my advice. Head for Rustboro City beyond this town. There you should challenge the gym leader, Roxanne. After her, go on to the other gyms and defeat their leaders. Collect badges from them, understood? Of course, I'm a gym leader too. We'll battle one day, Elmo. But that's only after you become stronger. Because otherwise, my slacking would wreck your team, and your nuzlocke would be over. Slacky would wreck our team anyway. Yeah. Well, guys, um, that's the end of the episode. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you, please, if you like this video, give it a like. Um, and subscribe. Subscribe definitely. Perseus the Lizard even says that, even if he is sleeping right now. Um, and if you have anything that... Comments. Yeah, comments, please do leave them below, especially villainous names. Like, I love villains, but I... It's gonna be really... I don't know too many of them. So, definitely give us some. Wait, what? Also, if you find out how to pronounce delay, whatever, whatever. Yeah. That's our question of the day. Yeah. How do you pronounce Galay? Or Galay? Or so, Galay? Well, goodbye, everybody. See you next time.